That's the key. Uh, ask questions, be open with people, and break out of the silo. The World Stem Cell Summit is extremely valuable, particularly in advocating uh, stem cell research. It brings together patients, physicians, scientists, regulators, investors, all the people who can make things happen. I've met a lot of people at uh, the World Stem Cell Summit that I've gone on to have some interaction with. And it's, it's really a valuable experience to meet people that aren't exactly the ones that I usually work with. I have, in fact, met scientists that I've gone on to collaborate with. That's the reason I go to conferences. You know, it's so important to have multiple voices in the field because you're really bringing together all individuals from different areas. And by sharing the information that you're basically finding along the way, and by interacting together, we can all move forward as a field. The value of the World Stem Summit to me is the intersection of ideas. It's bringing together not only my opinion, but it brings my ears to opinions of others. And when I see the excitement and enthusiasm that other people propose, it makes me a stronger person and a better scientist. The World Stem Cell Summit is a unique and absolutely invaluable conference. I think Bernie and the other members of the team have done an amazing thing in developing this conference as a really powerful interdisciplinary networking event, crossing a lot of disciplines, but also in the sense of bringing together academics and business people and investors and lay people and policy people. It's a really great model. Well, stem cell therapy represents the future of medicine that we might be able to use cells rather than drugs or surgery to improve health or possibly even deliver cures. Well, the implications of stem cell technology and regenerative medicine are huge because they will change healthcare as we know it today because you will be able to use part of your own body to heal yourself or other patients. It will be uh, procedures that are both cost-effective, safe, practical to uh, perform and that uh, will replace uh, drug and molecules and the pharmaceutical industry as we used to know it in the last century. It's a wonderful community event that involves patients, advocates, scientists, industry, government agencies. If you're a member of any one of those groups, you're going to learn and have the ability to interact with that entire community. It's a very important meeting for many different constituents. If someone was thinking of attending this event, I'd say it's a great introduction to the entire world of regenerative medicine.